going to talk about the three basics of breakaway roping. It's scoring, score, ride, rope. And it doesn't matter what level of roper you're at, what, no matter if you're just beginning, if you're in that improving stage or if you reach the highest levels, it all comes down to three basic things. You have to score your cattle, ride your horse into position, and rope the calf. Um, so for the more advanced roper, you can't be thinking about too many things at the same time because our brains just don't work that way and our event doesn't allow for that processes to happen in two to three seconds. So we are relying mainly on motor memory, which is why we have to practice so much and to get those motor memories driven into our brain and into our horses and that connection between you and your horse of what things mean. So you have to be able to score um, things like walk scoring, um, regular scoring, uh, being able to see certain amounts of the score, how much the calf is going to move before um, you go, things to work on that. When you're working on scoring is making sure that your horse is, is in your hand, meaning that he's not flat like this, that you have him here, and then he's up in your hand this way, um, riding your horse to that position. Um, and I've talked a lot about that. If your horse is standing like this in relationship to a calf that's going this way, so my horse is standing this way and my calf's headed this way, well then my body's all cattywampus and I don't have really good angles to be able to rope the calf, right? Because roping the calf is all about angles and having the correct angle for that relationship. So always remember the three basics, score, ride, rope, and uh, everything else will go from there.